sampling for microplastics. So what I'm doing is I'm using a uh, filter holder which has a 55 micron filter inside to filter the water from this Niskin bottle. It's basically enclosing the 55 micron mesh, which I'm not going to use now obviously because it's in contact with the outside. So water is going through the Niskin bottle, pulled by gravity, into the filter, and then into this enclosed car bottle. And all of this was prepared in clean conditions, so under laminate flow, to, pre to prevent any airborne like fibres getting in, and so that we're sure that, that the microplastics that we're sampling are actually from the sea and not from our clothes and what's all around us. Once we've done the first filtering stage, we take the filtered water and put it through a second filter, which is enclosed in this unit. So this has a one micron filter inside, which was prepared inside the laminar flow. We need a pump for this stage because one micron is too small a pore size for gravity to be able to work. So we'll start works with the 55 micron. As soon as the pore size gets smaller, you need to actually suck the water through. Any water that passes through this filter won't leave any traces of microplastics. It's going to go through the filter holder in the same way that it was with the CTV outside, straight through the carboy. So this is really important so that um, I know that if any, I find any plastic in my filters, it actually does come from the ocean and not the uh, outside air.